in the Xenoverse community. Modding and teabagging base offenses are considered especially heinous. In Xenoverse 2, the dedicated content creators who investigate these vicious acts are members from an elite group known as H.R. Bufu. And these are their stories. <laughs> Got a brand new lead on this sick Hey, Captain says, stop fooling around. There's been a homicide, you know? Um, I believe it was that Twitch thought that you like so much. Was one of the best Twitch thought streamers, such as Shay. How can he do this? Oh, I can he do this to her. She was my favorite. Yeah, it's crazy. What do you have so far? I mean, you should try that Quentin, that Quentin POS. He always knows something. He always knows what's going down. He might know what these guys are or what they're doing. Yeah, I talked to that Quentin piece of sh And he linked me up to this guy named uh, Discord Sky, I believe. Says that he lingers around the high schools and sells these mods. So let's go there. So you haven't seen her? When was the last time she attended? So what the teacher say? Says she hasn't been to school in weeks. Told us to go swing by her job. Yeah. You got any leads for me? Or are you going to charge me $700 for a f***ing scone? You. Hey. Majin tits. Do you have the information or not? Come on, we need answers. Instead of information, the fat pulls out candy out of his ass. <laughs> sad. All right, Gap is pretty upset. He says, meet you know who up on the roof. He needs to talk to you. Went on the roof to talk to Saitama. Says he just saw a kid buying mods in the city. Oh, man. They're everywhere now. He everywhere. It's like I'm gonna have to do something drastic. Super drastic. I'm gonna have to go undercover, like Cap said. Somebody needs to stop this, and it's got to be me. I got to stop this for more people end up victims of this homicidal. Alrighty, let's get it going, man. Let's get it going. Oh, chin check, chin check, chin check, you know. You already know where you are with this, man. New outfits, let's go. Basting out the first one, man, is one that's, like, super easy to do. Like, I mean... It's almost here, but it technically is here. As you can see right here, I'm chasing this little guy, right? But this outfit right here needs to be in the game. All right, I don't understand why it isn't for the CACs, but it's in the game right here. You see him, you see Kid Trunks. And it's all in his glory. I want the shoes, I want it all, I want everything, right? I try to match it as best as I could. I got pretty dang close though, but yeah, I, I, I want this, all right? Whether you damaged, not damaged, I don't care. I want this outfit. This outfit, Goten and him, both need to be in here, right? I, I mean, come on, like he's in figurines. Again, you could play with him. This outfit needs to be in here. You can make it, you can get super close. Um, We ain't got the sleeves, we need both. I, I covered to Goten, I gotta cover Kid Trunks, right? I gotta cover both of them. So Bandai, please, Dips, please, this outfit. Next up for real, now I know this will throw you off a little bit, right? Like, yeah, what? Like, Bobbity? Yeah, Bobbity. Bobbity, bibbity bobbity boo, right? Bobbity the magician, right? The little garlic junior magician thing guy, right? With the M, right? The, you know, the maker of the M. Now we got the M as an accessory, but we need Bobbity's outfit. Now this is a Majin I made it out of. I wanted two different styles, you know how it goes. But with the new Piccolo outfit, you can get pretty close. You know, then you only change the outfits. So that's basically what it is. We can change and mismatch outfits. We can make a lot more characters. Thus, the game has you know, more longevity, you know, up until it sadly might die when Sparking Zero appears. 
But if you add these things, it won't die. You know what I mean? Like, like look at this, man. Who doesn't want this outfit? I know it's a little skirt thing, a little dress thing, but it could be good on your female CECs like I'm showing you right now, right? I mean, it's all right. Now that's pants, skirt, or whatever. And again, Piccolo's top, and it makes boom, instant bobbity. We need this, all right? Next up for real. Oh, Omega, oh, okay? Oh, Omega Shenron, Sin Shenron, whatever. Boom, all right? <laughs> but anyway, um, Omega Shenron definitely needs to be in the game. Uh, I mess with it. I mess with it a lot. I know I hell, I know it's a little bad, but look at this. Look how we look on your CAC. It was a crazy, crazy dragon. It got the spikes, all that good stuff. It, I'm not doing it justice with mine. But look at this though. Look how the armor would look on you. Look how the Italy, I mean, you make you big and bulky. I'm fine with that. I'm really fine with that, man. Make you big, bulky, and all this stuff. Look at look at the, the feet. You know, you got the kneecap, spikes. I like it all. I like the spikes all over. All right, all the spikes. Or you can hit us up with the accessories, chest, the little Dragon Balls. You know, I'll rock with that um, for my CAC. Regardless of what race it is, it could be uh, like I just showed you Majin, or right here, Human, Earthling uh, slash Saiyan. But um, anyway, uh, or it can open it up to get the other dragon outfits, which would be cool, like I Shenron or something like that. Next up for real. Hey, Demi Gra the main antagonist of Xenoverse 1. Um, we get no love, right? <laughs> he gets no love, but uh, I, again, man, I, I'm not doing it justice with the outfit. I need this outfit, this outfit right here, right? He looks crazy. He is a good original character, which is why I respect Demi Gras as a good original character, especially for a game. He fits the perfect villain for a video game. Super spammy, super annoying, weird outfit, all of it, the hair, everything, everything you're seeing right here, right? I want it all, all right? I want it all. So um, they bring it, I change the colors. You already know how it goes with, with us, you know what I mean? We change the colors, we go crazy. We can make tons more things that way. But first, they have to put the outfit in the game, okay? Now, um, it would look great. Again, I like it, Demi Gras cool. I really want the outfit. That's my pitch, needs to be in here, dimps. Bandai, Dibs and Bandai, and the other guy, and the other people, right? Every company. We need this outfit now, man. Right now, right now, right? All right, next up, all right, next up. Now, I know he's Frost. Whack. I'm not really a fan of that outfit, like, but, but, but not this one, all right? Not the slam, all right? Talking about Frost's final form, right? Or well, what is his final form? Like Frieza, right? You know, like that one, right? Like this one. Now, I covered this uh, a while back, right? Um, but I, I gotta cover it again. I'm so sorry. It, it, just in case they missed it, we gotta show you another one. You, you know, we spin in the block, right? We gotta spin it back. All right, look at this, look at this. Now, on your CACs, it can go crazy. That's all I'm saying. On my CAC, it will be magic. That's all I'm saying, man. Don't you want it to be magic? Yes, you do, okay? I wanna change the colors. I want it to be in here, custom key. I don't care. However we get the Frost outfit, we need it. We got every other outfit, but the Frost one. I'm gonna be honest, look at this. I want this. We got King Cold, Mecha Frieza, Cooler, all those, right? I want to be Golden Frost. <laughs> like, I just want the outfit, man. Please, please. I'm pleading, right? I'm pleading. Pretty good pleading, right? All right. Oh, man, this is bad. Every time I see it. Yeah. <laughs> but you already know, man. Um, Number one outfit right here, right? Cyberman, okay? A Cyberman outfit is an absolute must, all right? I've. I want this thing so bad, all right? I want this thing so bad. I want to be a Cyberman. I want to blow things up, right? Final explosion. I want to go crazy. I want a giant Cyberman. I want to look weird, right? I want the feet and hands so I can do stuff with them. The feet and hands mostly what I wanted for it, all right? So the feet and hands go a long way, as you're seeing right here. Look at this, flipping everybody off. The feet and hands go crazy. I want the feet and hands, most of it. Just, just mostly the feet and hands. Okay, now we need this outfit, it would be great. The legs look weird, I know, but that's fine. You just need the outfit. I mean, you don't have to wear the outfit like that. Just rock with the feet and hands with me. The feet and hands, man, okay? So we can do special things like Cyber King or Cyber Saiyan, right? Like, right, like any of those, right? Now, we respect anything you've seen today. And if you appreciate the builds and the things I showed you, I really appreciate you hitting that like button sharing commenting and all that good stuff that youtubers love to tell you okay i'm no different uh, so yeah i'll see y'all in the comment section man let me know 
on my next video, I gotta let you guys know they let us down with this DLC, and I gotta tell you why, and show you why. So I'll see y'all in the next episode, right? Peace. Thank you.